So heterogeneous flooring is basically the layer, a layered process. It has a different performance standard, ASTM F1303, and it has a different type of production method. So plastisol, which is a liquid mixture of PVC, uh, dispersion of PVC resin, plasticizers and fillers and additives that has a consistency of a paste. The paste or plastisol is applied by a coating process and transformed into, into the solid state by heating. This is called jellification in the diagram shown. And so heterogeneous can also be calendared similar to homogeneous sheet vinyl, but this gives you an opportunity to see that there's multiple layers that come together that are put into the product. And you'll see that in the construction diagram. So there's a fiberglass reinforced base in, in some heterogeneous products. There's also this performance layer that gives you the visual and the texture, the designer printed visual. So this is the technology has done some great things for the vinyl industry because of being able to get these great high resolution digital printed visuals. And so then a specialty top coat would then go over that, that as well. So there are a variety of structures. This diagram is representative of one of the heterogeneous sheet vinyl flooring structures. Some do not include the designer printed visual layer, and there are those with and without some type of backing cloth. So it's just good to know that this is an example of the construction, but you can see that it's multi-layered versus homogeneous. That is a single layer with a top coat. The installation considerations that govern the vinyl sheet products like we talked about for heterogeneous it, it does not, it is not as for heat welding is more sensitive to heat. So it has less tolerance uh, so compared to where, what you would have with homogeneous. Heterogeneous vinyl may provide slightly higher margin of error for sub pour prep because it is embossed and the patterns are inherent to the vinyl. So it has a greater propensity to not telegraph the imperfections as you would have with homogeneous in the sub pour. So we know that the, the texture helps basically in terms of evaluating any, anything that might be a problem or an imperfection in the subfloor from coming through and telegraphing. So the technological advancements with not only authentic wood and stone visuals, but you also have other abstracts and other types of patterning that are utilized. Uh, the technology advancements have really allowed these products to be much more attractive in terms of just the, the aesthetics and the variety of aesthetics, I think is really the point. It is available in wide widths for seamless installation. It has seamless flooring with uh, excellent top-down moisture protection. It comes in both loose lay and direct glue down installation, and it really is beautifully responsible.